Yeah. You better believe it. 12 mil plywood. One of the other things we do here at Generate Printing. So today we're doing a, a job for our good friends at the Green Roof in Hamilton. Great feed there as well. Anyway, so this is for their dartboard. So we're probably going to do... I might do an underflood, a white underflood. It is a, an, a black, white, and red image. Um, I think it is an image of a fish. So I thought about doing, like, making that as a kind of underflood and that and make everything else pop. But I'm just going to do the whole thing white underflood to show you what we can do on plywood. 12 mil plywood printing. Look out, let's give it a build. Let me set up on the printer and let's go from there. Catch you soon. <laughs> So ladies and gentlemen, here is the finished product of, let, let me show you that it is uh, 12 mil. Is that 12 mil, Brad? It looks 12 mil. Yeah, it's all about the girth. We talk about the girth. Anyway, so um, <laughs> some are a little bit smaller than the others. Anyway, nothing wrong. So just check this out. So what we did is we only did like a 100% white underflight and CMYK because those lines that you see in the print, that's actually the grain of the timber. Hang on, see if there's... So that's the grain, so that way you see that it is actual timber. Beautiful. So the benefits of uh, using our latex inks and even cutting it on the router, look at that, no chipping. Besides the shit, uh, I used a, maybe a, a blunt uh, router bit. But that's the benefits of printing on plywood. So we can print up to 50 mil. That's right, 50 mil. Again, Brad, it's all about the girth. <laughs> that's right. It's all about the girth. Anyway, one of the many applications we do here at Generate Printing, Printing on timber, printing on rubber matting, uh, wall padding, or oh, kneeling pads. Pete had kneeling, kneeling pads. Pad. And many, many more things. So uh, get in contact with us to see what other applications we can print. Tuck, pack, put it up. Have a great one.